The city of Cape Town is spending hundreds of millions of rand on sewer upgrades for the Cape Flats. The 715 million rand pipeline rehabilitation project is expected to benefit around 300,000 in lower income neighborhoods. Now it's expected to be completed by 2025. Clogged drains and overflowing sewers are sometimes due to the city's overstretched and ailing infrastructure. But here's ENCS Nobesu Tuhe China with more on the story. City of Cape Town officials say they are on track to complete the full 28 kilometers of this pipeline rehabilitation project in the next two years. At least 3,000 households in areas like Athlone, Hanover Park, Lotus River, Ortery, Grassy Park, Eagle Park, and areas around Pelican Park will benefit. A water-resistant camera will be used to not only assist maintenance workers when they encounter difficulties on the ground, but also spot clog and blockages during the build. So this is a very exciting project. It's a huge upgrade to the Cape Flats main sewer line. Uh, there's actually two of them, and it's about 750 million rand over the next few years. And what's really exciting, so if, firstly, it's the biggest sewer upgrade project in the whole of South Africa. Secondly, part of it, a great part of it, is actually being done robotically. The material used to manufacturing the pipes is said to withstand the test of time, as they can last up to 100 years. But most importantly, according to engineers, foreign objects usually found when cleaning clogged drains won't damage the pipes. Like with the old, the old ones, we actually have to go and physically dig up the entire street. You have to dig up um, the entire pipeline. Some of the pipelines are up to six meters deep. So you'd actually have to open up uh, probably like a five or six meter trench to get the old pipe out and dispose of the old pipe and then put in a new pipe. Um, because we're working in residential areas, um, it's impossible to do that. You will never be able to dig up the, the old pipeline. And this, the two pipelines are running next to each other. So you have the one uh, pipeline, Cape Platz 1 and Cape Platz 2, and they're about five meters apart. So it would be a, a massive excavation, which would be significantly more expensive and much more difficult to do. Some residents in Hanover Park say they are hopeful these upgrades will offer relief from their constant struggles of overflowing sewers. We have like dams of water laying in the road here, especially that one there. And the drain on the corner there, there's always water bubbling up from underneath, underneath the drain. But um, if the city is improving on, 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 on ways to, to improve all of this, it will work. I think it will work. Over the next three years, the city says it will invest a billion rand for similar upgrades in other areas within the Cape Flats, Philippi, Milton and Gordons Bay. 130,000 jobs are expected to be created. Nabesutu Echana, Cape Town.